How's it going everybody, Dr. Doyle here with another round of Dragon Ball Fighters news and just V-Jump news in general. Uh, and it is finally confirmed you guys, I know that after several round of teases from wait till the 26th and 27th to the tweet that said a mighty warrior from Universe 11 was arising, that was when we probably knew for sure that it was going to be Jiren, but I know I saw a lot of people both joking and not joking saying, oh you know it could be Topo or maybe it's actually Dispo, uh, but we now have full confirmation, 100%, we have our first visuals of Jiren versus Blue Goku here uh, and what looks like a dramatic shot. Now unfortunately the scan around these two doesn't give us too much information. In fact from what I could roughly translate it pretty much just adds up to uh, Jiren and Goku clash uh, yada 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 wait till the 26th and 27th. So it's not like we haven't heard this bit all before. That being said though it is nice to get our first actual visual of what Jiren is going to look like in this game albeit the scan isn't in the highest quality. I also think it's curious as to how they paired him up with Super Saiyan Blue Goku. Remember they did say that a hint would be in the upcoming V-Jump. I don't know if that was about the past one or this one, uh, but if it is this one, it would be very hard to classify Jiren himself as a hint. <laughs> and the last two things I wanted to talk about with this image, uh, and these are both just, you know, conspiracy theories almost, uh, but this looks very dramatic, like this looks like a dramatic shot. Usually with these scans, we just get shots of like their supers or cinematic angles from, you know, some of their specials, uh, but this time around it's just a an action pose. So whether this is just a very cinematic Jiren special, maybe it's a counter or something, uh, to me, this looks more along the lines of a dramatic intro slash dramatic finish. And if that is the case, where are these two fighting? If you look in the background, it's just pure darkness. Uh, we have a stage in the game like that already, uh, you know, on the moon or meteorite or whatever. Uh, but could this be alluding to a tournament of power stage? Hopefully. Uh, that is something I would definitely 100% want to see. But yeah, other than that, it's only the one image and text telling us to wait. I, I'm more than excited. I'm glad they didn't reveal anything too big with Jiren here because I would much rather see it all come out during the finals. Now very quickly moving on to other V-Jump news that isn't related to Dragon Ball Fighters or Dragon Ball for that matter, Jump Force actually added a ton of new characters from the Naruto universe, and the four characters they added were Kaguya, Boruto, Gara, and Kakashi. And apparently this actually completes the Naruto roster, so if you were hoping for someone like Obito or Madara, uh, it doesn't look like they're going to be in the base game at least. Now out of these four characters, the only one we got a good scan for was Boruto. You can see him in the game here. To me, he actually looks like the best character, at least visually so far, his design definitely made the transition uh, the best. And in the skins themselves, we just get shots of Boruto using the Rasengan and also one of him throwing a clone. And we also get a cool shot of what looks to be a Jump Force PS4. And that was pretty much it guys, that was pretty much all the big news from V-Jump, or at least the stuff that I'm super interested in. Uh, if you play Dragon Ball Legends, they're adding Kaelin Khalifla, uh, but other than that, yeah, that's that's pretty much all. Obviously not the longest video in the world, but you know how I uploaded that video saying Jiren is probably coming and it was a warrior from Universe 11. Uh, a lot of people were, you know, jokingly and unjokingly uh, getting hyped up as to who it could be. Uh, so I just felt it was probably the best thing to do to come out and say, yes, it is 100% Jiren now. Uh, so those that were looking forward to that can be happy. Uh, and those that weren't, uh, there's still hope. You know, there's still more DLC down the line. I wouldn't completely throw out the chance of uh, Topo or Dispo. But yeah, guys, other than that, let me know what you're thinking on all this news down below. The Jump Force stuff, the Dragon Ball Fighter stuff. Do you think that's going to be a tournament of power stage? Most importantly, because come on, please. <laughs> While you're down there, if you like these videos and you want to see more of them from the channel, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe so that you never miss out on an update for the upcoming Season 2 for Dragon Ball Fighters. I'll be covering it all on this channel to the best of my ability. That means the character reveals, the trailers, the, the Shonen Jump releases, all of it, and it's just going to be a lot of fun. Other than that, i got a few videos up on your screen right now that you can feel free to check out if you're interested. I'm Dato Doya. Thank you so much for watching the video. I'll see you in the next one.